What's going on guys? It's Milton from Plastisol Heat Transfer Mastermind. And in today's video, we are going to be doing full color transfer. Got them right here for you. Uh, from Transfer Express, there's two different kinds here. And we're gonna be doing some V-necks and also some sweaters that I'm gonna be doing with these. So, um, I hope you're interested. These are ultra soft, full color transfers from Transfer Express. And if you don't know what's in this box yet, make sure you watch yesterday's video where I opened up this box and tell you how to order one of these. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. That way when I upload, you will be notified of our next videos. So, let's get started. And first, we gotta cut these up. So So we're gonna do v-necks for women and so and also some sweaters and I'll show you guys but uh, since it is v-neck and the seam is right here we are going to uh, use a pillow, Teflon pillow, we're gonna put it inside we're going to preheat it for a couple of seconds we're going to put the transfer put a special paper that came with the transfers and then we're going to heat press it for about 15 seconds um, and then the temperature is should be around uh, from 280 to 310 around there um, and so then Now here's another thing. This is a cold peel. Okay, and That is super important for you guys to know what type of transfers you're dealing with Because if it's hot peel as soon as you open the heat press you peel it Right it, there's no problem. It's if, if it's a cold peel and you peel it right after you open up the heat press is you're gonna mess up the transfer. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what I do. I think there's a special eraser, I don't have it. It's like a, it looks like a little eraser that you put over it uh, to help it cool faster. I don't have it, I might get it in the future, but um, I use a regular shirt that's not one of these and I just, you know, pass on top of the transfer so it can cool a little faster. I put it aside and then come back to peel it. So let me show you guys how I do the V-necks and um, and then if you have any questions or anything, just comment down below and let's get to it. then you can peel them, okay? So let's start with this one right here to just make sure they're cool.
And there you go. Very smooth, very soft, colorful, it's nice. Okay, and that is it, guys. Thank you for watching till the end. I have an extra scene for you guys, a blooper, what you shouldn't do. But also, I just want to say thank you for uh, all the support you've given me this year. Uh, thank you for, you know, liking, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. Next year, we're going to be doing more videos and just trying to help more people, you know, as many as I can. And I hope you guys have a blessed New Year's. I hope next year is way better than this year because this year was not that great, right? And what's most important is just health, right? Hope your family is doing well. And, um, you know, I'm praying for you guys. I pray for everybody that watches this channel and that God may bless you on this coming year. So peace out, guys. Happy New Year's. Hey, guys, so let me show you something, right? Something that you shouldn't do. This is what happens when you don't let it cool all the way. Okay, so I took off the, as you can see here, let me show you. So these are cooling off, right? I haven't taken these off. So I'm, these are cooling off. And I actually peeled one without letting it cool off completely. And let me show you the results. So you don't do what I did. See? You see? It ripped off. So wait for it to cool off, okay?